Hope you're well, welcome to my channel. So this is where I talk about Twin Flame Process and these are the monthlies by Sunsign for September 2023. If anybody wants to get a more in-depth personal reading or do a Skype session, all my information is on my website and the link to that is in the description box below. So I hope you have a very good month, lots of love and see you in the next video. So oh, this is your reading for September 2023. Right, so straight away I'm getting Six of Pentacles uh, visual in my head, which is somebody making contact. I'm getting conversations, you're in conversation with someone, uh, quite a lot of talking going on. And they're talking about building the dream. So this is a, something about a project, a growth project, building something together. Um, it does feel like you're entering into some kind of partnership this month. And um, it's going to grow really strongly. I've also got the energy of the person that you're going into partnership with as being really strong, actually. And maybe you feel that this person is a bit overbearing or you feel overshadowed by this person in some way um, but this person is to, to your benefit so they might have kind of a big mouth it feels like maybe they talk a lot and they're quite um they're saying vociferous they talk a lot and they're maybe you feel like you don't get a word in edgeways something like that um but it's all for you it's all good they're saying so you don't have to worry about anything you don't have to, um, they're saying you don't have to take it on board, right? So this person needs to let off a lot of steam. This person that you're going to have contact with needs to let off a lot of steam and say a lot of stuff. And you're just going to let it kind of flow by you and not invest your energy into trying to come up with conclusions and answers in relation to what they've said. So it's not about you answering any of their questions or giving them a point of view or an opinion or anything like that. It's just about you allowing them to like voice everything and get it out, basically. So it may or may not be your twin flame. They're not saying. They're just showing me the energy of two people and you quite small and uh, quiet and this other person uh, roaring. <laughs> you know like really loud and it's not shouting or anything but they did say the lion let the lion roar or something like that it might be a leo coming to you as well then if you're looking at this in another sign this is a leo coming to you <clears throat> let's get some cards out see what else they say three of pentacles so creation and growth so this is what this is about this month for you and that's in the physical domain, so something arriving in the physical domain. They're saying the penny dropping, the light coming in. Knight of Wands, which is energy moving something forward. So it's coming from an energetic place to a physical place. It's manifesting. Something is manifesting for you this month in terms of something physical. Uh, showing me a lot of activity, a lot of um, hustle and bustle. A lot of you kind of running around the place. It feels like you're going to be out and about. Maybe you're going to be buying new things, doing some shopping. I've got this energy of like doing like new things. So it feels like maybe you might be buying new things for where you live or new things for yourself. I've got you kind of running around with a bunch of flowers. It's like you're going to be like setting up your uh, wherever it is that you live and making it look really nice. Something like that. Maybe because you've got something coming. Someone coming to visit, <clears throat> Nine of Swords, which is an ending to everything you've been through. So you've got this energy this month of just you like, you are running around like a headless chicken a bit. You've got loads to do. But that's actually really good because you're not thinking about anything apart from these things that you've got to do. So there's no like um, sitting around and worrying, you know, or sitting around and hoping or wishing or any of that. It's like action, 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 getting on with things, moving around hustle bustle you've got a lot on your back burner they're saying so <clears throat> whatever it is that you normally think about or have you know it's like the main thing that is in your head maybe unanswered questions <clears throat> excuse me I've got a bit of hay fever maybe um unanswered questions you know where you contemplate things it's all going on the back burner you're just going to be like 
uh, moving forward, this energy moving forward and you moving forward and you like, I got you grabbing at things in shops, you know, like, oh, it's the last one on the shelf, I'm going to have that. And just like really throwing yourself into this activity. Six of Wands, success in vibration. And of course, that is the um, bringing you into a vibrational accuracy. So whatever it is that you're being asked to do this month, which is movement, out and about, physically moving, you know, whatever that looks like on the surface, uh, buying things, shopping, it's not that small in meaning. It's a bigger meaning. It is, it's going to bring you into this bright and beautiful vibration, they're saying, where you are just like alive and feeling alive and feeling, you know, all this excitement building inside you is what I've got. And like every time you see something, you grab it off the shelf, you're like, oh, that's just what I wanted. <laughs> you know, oh, I really need that. And it's like such, a, it's like Christmas morning, they're saying, you know. And you get all your presents and you open things up and you're like, oh, this is exactly what I wanted and I'm so happy. And you've got all this excitement building inside you. Ace of Wands right in the middle. So you've got point of attraction. So just like they say, it's bringing you into your, like really magnification of a really good feeling is what you're going to have this month through this like outward bound activity. And just like moving around and happy and jumping around and no time to think. They're saying no time to think. And then we've got Page of Swords, which is communication and messages. And that's coming from that. So whether this person that's coming to you for the communication is going to come after all this activity, possibly. Maybe you're going to have more activity because the person's already come to you. I would say this vibration of accuracy is coming first and then the message. But we never know really. It might be that it could be either way around. Something very profound is going to happen this month, they're saying. Where they're showing me the figure of the person that's speaking, it's really big. This figure is really big. So it's a really profound influence in your life, a really profound person. Like you think, I think you feel like this person is God almost. So this must be your twin flame because your twin flame is a representation of source outside of self. And it's like it's, this person is like a representation of God to you. So it's like, beyond human right it's more like the understanding of what this person means in a bigger in a bigger expression of what your life has been about and so you know it's almost like you have a disconnect as well going on in terms of like how you used to be able to think in a very negative way i've got you with like this like open mouth kind of almost like dumb kind of shock of what's just happened in terms of like this person arriving in your life and you're like oh my god <laughs> exactly right oh my god <laughs> uh, there they are you know and it's like I can't think anymore <laughs> you're not going to be able to think it's like I'm so like sh profoundly shocked at your appearance that I can't think and I can't speak so all I can do is do <laughs> and then we've got you running around seven of pentacles fruition in the physical world ending of your, they said, ending of your sorrow just then, vibrational accuracy, point of attraction, and something arriving from that. Good, the sun, so it's all good, you've got a really good month coming up, I mean, it's in terms of activity, and uh, excitement, and, and light, they're saying like enlivenment, you know, feeling alive, and feeling like, like, just in love with being alive, basically, like life couldn't be better, like something to live for kind of energy. And then we've got justice. And that's everything being all right, basically. And everything being the way it should be. And that it's, you know, everything kind of being answered in the justice. It's like, oh, okay, now I see. Now I see what it's all about. And it's all been right all along. And it was always what it was, what I thought it was. And, and it's just like, it's a big aha moment, basically, coming in terms of your own self and an unburdening of your... Um, something that's been pinning you down or anchoring you into like some kind of negativity and then we've got underneath just go with the flow and let it all go you know and do what you're guided to do so you know some people say like oh shopping that's really really egotistical no it's not because everything that's physical that we do has a deeper meaning it has an energetic resonance right so if you're guided to run around, uh, you know, TJ Maxx or TK Maxx or as I so sometimes are, and you find yourself coming to in a trance after a trance state with something in your hand and like, oh, that's what I've always wanted. 
that's there's a reason for it. It's like in generating energy, and you had the Knight of Wands there, so it's generating movement forward. And in Twin Flame connection, the feminine going with the flow and doing what they're guide, asked to do by their vibrational self, which is whatever you're asked to do on that day, whether it's the washing up or the cleaning the house or the shopping in the mall, whatever you're asked to do and just going with the flow of that is what you're meant to be doing. That's what it's about, right? That's what the spirituality is about. It's about you're here to live a life and do what you're guided to do. So I'll leave you with that. Um, you are going to have a very good month. Leo, and also any Leos that you're watching this for are going to have a very good month of movement. Lots of love. See you in the next one.